Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you about ureteral cell imaging. Demnology. Ureteral cell is a condition, is a congenital cystic dilatation of distal submucosal portion of one or both ureter within urinary bladder. Categorized according to ureteral cell position. Intra vesical completely contained within bladder. Extra vesical partially extend to bladder next, urethra, vagina, prostate, seminal vesicle, and perine or perineum. Categorized according to urethral cell insertion. Autotopic it means simple. Orify is located in not more anatomic portion in bladder trigone. Ectopic orify is local, located anywhere else. Categorize according to type of kidney drain. Single system with a duplicated system with two ureter. ureter. One ureter of duplicated system must be a topic. Richard Mayer rule. Ureter from upper pole moiety of duplicated kidney insert inferior and major to normal lower pole moiety insertion size at trigon. Any ureteral cell may abstract and cause hydrolysis. Most common sign symptom prenatal detection of hydronephrosis is typical. Febrile urinary tract infection is most common postnatal presentation. Other sign symptom. Simple urethral cell may not be diagnosed until adulthood. Ectopic urethral cell is usually diagnosed in infancy or shortly after toilet training, present with hematuria, UTI, chronic aneurysis, or hydronephrosis, rarely present with prolapse and acute bladder outlet obstruction. Other rare presentation, failure to size, cyclic abdominal pain, ureteral calculus. Demographic. Age detected uh, antenatally and infancy. Ethnicity most frequent in white. Epidemiology one over four thousand children less frequently diagnosis in adult. Sex ectopic urethral cell more than in female more than male. Imaging around avoid filling defects in urinary bladder, sin wall, and cystic appearing on or the sound um, you are. What appeared sicker collapse after surgery. Plus minus visualization of associated dilated distal ureter in replicated system, upper moiety associated with ureteral cell, typically obstruction and LP, lower moiety, moiety type called reflux. Varying degree of hydronephrosis and parenchymal dysplasia of UP, uh, upper moiety, which go you Retero reflux into lower moiety, classically so dropping lily signs due to rotation of lower pole system by abstracted UP. This is the ultrasound of urinary bladder in an 18 day old with prenatal detected hydronephrosis, so a large sinuosis 
feeling much of the bladder lumen, typical of a uterine cell. Disease contact to a dilated distal left ureter. Frontal early feeling imaging from VCUG in the same patient. So the uterine cell has a large void feeling effects. Partially outlined by contrast in the urinary bladder. Post void VCUG in the same patient, so grade 2 3 vesicle ureter reflux into the lower bowel collecting system, the dropping. Lily configuration of contrast within the lower bowl strongly suggests absorption of the of a upper bowl moiety. The upper ureteral cell remain visible in the contrast field bladder. C2 FSMI in a in an infant, so an atopic ureteral cell partially filling ureterine, urinary bladder and connecting to the, a markedly dilated UP ureter. There is severe upper bowl. Hydronephrosis due to absorption. Note the normal lower pole moiety. T1C plus FSMI in the same patient, so no contrast in the ureteral cell. Due to long standing upper pole obstruction with decreased function, contrast has filled the surrounding bladder by excreted from the remaining urinary tract. Public ultrasound, so the fluid field distal ureter and ureteral cell within the bladder in this patient with duplicated left kidney. Treatment, endoscopic insertion, incision of ureteral cell, especially if infected or obstructed in neonate. Following incision, ureteral cell wall appears seen in sicker, sicken, irregular, even mass-like, Endoscopic incision may convert obstructed urethrosal into a reflux urethrosal. Lower pole dilatation may improve with upper pole urethrosal incision. Double puncture technique, double J stand insert into two puncture size at all of ectopic ureteral cell and tissue is fulgurated. Ureteral re-implantation surgery, extra vesicle re-implantation, ureteral ureterectostomy, ureteropelostomy, patient undergoing bilateral ectopic Ureteral cell repair are at increased risk for postoperative voiding dysfunction. Unclear if risk is present preoperative or due to trigonal surgery. Hemi nephro if upper moiety 
is very poorly functioning. Antenatal pestoscopic laser ablation of urethrosa performed in fetus with severe bilateral hydronephrosis, bladder outlet absorption, and oligohydromose with good result. Success after single procedure is higher in single urethra, may require more than one surgery procedure. Thank you.